So, hi. I'm gonna sound a little sniffly in this video and it might sound a little echoey. Hopefully I find a solution in a little while for that. I might even make a video on it. So yeah, let's get into the video. Hope you enjoy. Oh yeah, so also most of this video over, over the audio, I'm gonna have the original files for the video and those are only in 480p. So if it looks a little grainy, that's why. One year ago, I made a video called Snowfall 2016. Well, it may be one of my lesser populars and maybe not the best video. It marked an important milestone for my YouTube channel. That was the first video that I edited with a real video editor. I don't remember if I had used a YouTube video editor before, but it's not like I could go back and see my old project. If you want to learn why that is, look in the description. All right, shameless promotion aside, let's talk about what makes me appreciate that video so much. And it's how, with the snow that fell in the video, so did some of the things that didn't exactly make my channel exactly the best. You might wonder what that means. So basically, most of the things that didn't make my channel exactly the highest quality started to go away. Here are the two main examples that started around a month after the video was made. The first one is me getting the Blue Yeti, which really took away the part that most people didn't really like about my channel. The second is how I started to change my content up. You see, if you go back to before this video, it's mostly Let's Plays for either Soul Zero, Unturned, Adventure Capitalist. Let's never talk about my Adventure Capitalist series. Okay, okay, good talk. So with most of the content being that really an out of the norm video is just doing a Let's Play on a different game, you probably think of the Blueprint Tycoon and Prison Architect series, and you'd be right. You see, the three videos before Snowfall 2016, one really changed my channel quite a bit. For two of them were tutorials, and the first one and the first one of them showed me that they were nice videos to make and got quite a few views from my channel at the time. But the second of the two was really me just deciding to film me making a little mobile base and sniping some zombies somehow hit it big. At the time of writing this video, it's currently sitting at 108 views and it's currently the fourth most popular video on my channel. But let's talk about the other video. I don't think it needs that much of an introduction. It's currently the third most popular video on my channel. Of course, it's the Wild Alaska one. This one is important mainly because I believe that it was the first video to get over 100 views. It kind of proved to me that this YouTube thing is kind of going somewhere. But after Snowfall, videos started to get higher quality, either by slowly starting to edit them to make them just a little that little bit better. Also, like I said, me getting the Blue Yeti, which really made my channel feel very professional, even if it really wasn't. Let's go and talk about some things that happened quite a bit after this video. The main things after this are the Groundhog's Day video and the mod reviews. The Groundhog's Day one is really what showed me that making a nice video with a script and decent editing would yield me good results. I believe that it quickly became my first, I believe that it quickly became my second or third most popular video around a month after it was uploaded. At the time of writing this video, it is currently sitting at 54 views and is the eighth most popular video on my channel. And the final video I'm going to talk about is Lax's Military Mod Pack Review. While on the surface this video might not look like a hard video to make on the surface, but let's just say that finding locations and a flow for things like that takes a while. That's even without the amount of time that it takes to spawn in the huge amount of vehicles contained in that mod pack. Currently, the result of that hard work is over 1,000 views and it's easily the most popular video on my channel as it has over four times the views of the second most popular video, which also happens to be the video that I'm most proud of. And like I said, I'm not gonna talk about it. So I guess you're just gonna have to go and watch it. Is that the second promotion I made in this video? Well, I guess the YouTube video editor video is definitely my favorite. So I hope you all enjoyed watching that video and I hope you kind of realize a little bit of the history of my channel, you know, with the uh, snowfall and then, you know, sort of the things that happened after it that sort of made my channel what it is today. So yeah, thanks for watching. This has been TNT Productions and I hope to see you in the next video. Later, bye.